Now, just three days into the new year, my people, as people still they celebrate, still they chop the chicken of the new year, 2022. Hmm, some families don't they throw, they don't throw the, some families into money, no. And who throw them into money? <laughs> Not debt itself. Three prominent Nigerians, where at least a lot of people know who they be, they don't go meet uh, Papa God for heaven, no. Just hours after we say Happy New Year. Welcome to 2022. And the prominent people, now the first, uh, the presidential, former presidential candidate, uh, Bashir Tofa. And we also hear about the Oba of uh, Ilubadon, Oba, uh, Ilubadon of Ibadan. And then uh, this wonderful ex Oshun State Governor. The first person we want to talk about now, this uh, Bashir Tofa, will be former presidential candidate. Now, the man died early hours on Monday at the age of 74 after. A particular illness with a new disclose. Now, in close associate uh, Galadima, now he talk about the death in an Instagram post. He talk say Al Hawakba, we eventually lost Al Haji Bashu Tofa. May Allah grant him eternal rest. We go remember, say Tofa, na presidential candidate for National Republican Convention for June 12, 1993, will be the most freest election for Nigeria even till date. And now he start alongside with uh, Chief MKO. Abiola to contest for that particular uh, election. He scored 11 states, but uh, Abiola scored 19 states. So, during the Second Republic, Tofa was at various times the Secretary of Kano State uh, Branch of the ruling party, NPN, and he later became the National Financial Secretary and the National Member of the Green Revolution National uh, Party. So, in the very, very, very prominent for politics. In 1993, the Ibrahim Babangida administration introduced option 4 and Tofa was selected the presidential candidate of the NRC. And in conclude the uh, uh, presidential candidate, and like I talked before, he joined uh, Abiola as a, an opponent and uh, Abiola actually won the election and issue later on about that. Hmm. Another issue, now the man, the oldest among the three, uh, Oba Olubadon of Ibadan, Oba Ade Tunji Salim. Now this man, you go see, say this one arrived old age, now he die. And a lot of people come, they come out talk say na COVID nineteen kill him. But um, the palace aides and the palace um, representative don't talk say no be COVID nineteen na kill Baba. Say Baba died of you know old man illness, which normal at the age of ninety three. I beg, waiting to remain safe. So um. Because the death was not um, really, you know, attended to like COVID-19 death. They, you know, a lot of people were still around and all that. Though they took care of him and all that. So if it was actually a COVID-19 death, definitely they would not allow such an um, issue. So, old man, rest in peace. The last but not the least, now this uh, former military administrator of uh, Oshun State, Anthony Obi. News agency of Nigeria reports say Mr. Obi. Now retired colonel and he served for the state military as state ministry governor from August 1996 to August 1998. And Mr. Obi say in died for January 1. Uh, the Osho State President Governor took on for in statement by a medic, uh, media aid for Sunday on Osho in Oshobo in console with the family of the disease and held his contribution towards the development of governance in Osho State. In talk say Mr. Obi be one of the leaders who laid the foundation of the states. In talk say in debt na huge loss not only to the family but also to the nation. Say in be brave, committed, and experienced military officer who served Nigeria and Oshu states in particular selflessly and passionately. So my people, this one debt no know who get money and who no get. Even as we they celebrate 2022. Three families don't they throw into money. We sympathize with their family and we pray for fortitude to bear this loss. My people now we say I guess for now so the hot matter be that too. You never like, you never subscribe. I beg press that subscribe button to support us to do more. Thank you so much till I see you in my next episode of Acid Hot. Keep being good and ensure say you join me for the headline news for tomorrow.